there is a Kenyan lady mwenye ako US kuna msichana mkenya ako United States huyu msichana anaitwa Koi huyu ndio msichana mwenye alilik video ya Sharon yenye Shadow alikuwa captured akikunywa simu na hiyo video ilikuwa captured na mwenye alikuwa anafaa kumsaidia mimi ni msema kweli na mimi ninapenda ukweli Sharon alikuwa na shida zake tu kama mwanamke but the good thing before DJ Brownski namchukue alijua Sharon ako na hizo shida mabeshte za Sharon wengi walikuwa lesbian lakini Sharon alikuwa bisexual by the time <coughs> in fact DJ Brownskin alikuwa anga na Sharon but alikuwa anajua Sharon alikuwa anapenda kukatia madim ye yeah, alikuwa tu bisexual anakatiana na bado kwa nyumba yake analimwa lakini niko na machungu sana na ma, list ya madim kumi na wawili jana nilimalizana na dem anaitwa Anji lakini siku malizana na yeye kabisa ninarudi kwake tena Anji Anji ni sister ya Nyambu Nyambu ni mama ya msichana anaitwa Shaniz ama Slay DJ Brownskin DJ Brownskin wewe ni takataka DJ Brownskin wewe ni gasia DJ Brownskin ulikula anji na asifi ya itoshi DJ Brownskin bado ukarudi ukakula mpaka Slay ambaye ni mtoto wa Nyambu hiyo kitu venye Sharon aligundua yani DJ Brownskin ni fisi mpaka inakula mtu na anti yake anakula anji tena anakula mpaka niswa anji Slay Slay mtoto wa Nyambu na Nyambu wewe ulikuwa unajua vizuri anji ni beshte damu wa kufa kupona wa Sharon Shadodo fulufulu na bado unaacha sister yako anaharibu nyumba ya beshte yake Almasi na kupenda tena na kutambua sana kuna beshte ya Shadodo alikuwa anaitwa Almasi kama kuna dem aliumwa na kifo ya huyo dem ni Almasi Almasi alilima punda wakiwa club lofti alishika punda alipiga alipiga nyambu mbaya sana and i'm happy because you took it into your own hands to condemn an evil that happened while everybody else had the power to stop that evil sasa mimi nataka kueleza vitu chache sharon ameacha watoto wawili mmoja anaitwa sherin mumbi na mwingine anaitwa trevis huyu trevis anaitwa aka babake anapenda kumuita popo ilifika mahali dj bronski na amekuwa toxic mpaka ana discriminate huyu mtoto anaitwa sherin mumbi kwa sababu hakuzaliwa ndani ya wedlock before sharon na dj brownskin wa wane sharon alikuwa demi ya mjaka fulani anaitwa oposh oposh ndo baba ya sherin kuna venye oposh na dj brownskin bado anafanya research walikuwa mabeshte walikuwa mabeshte but sasa brownskin through to hii ujanja ujanja zake na ukora zake ni kama alikuja ka convince nani e, sharon sharon akaachana na nani na oposh but aliachana na oposh kama washafanya nini washaza ndio akarudi akazalia dj travis nani mtoto mwenye anaitwa popo of course relation ya oposh na sharon pia ilikuwa na shida zake juu oposh ni mtu wa kupiga piga bibi makofi wa kuchuna masikio and i think it led to their separation na kitu kama hiyo last few days last few months a month or two before her death sharon miscarried na mimi mtu akusema ukweli sharon miscarried when uh, the truth about her medical condition came to her realization na ni kama aliona it is a mess yenye ange live nayo relationship imeenda mbaya and above all anaenda ana usi aka confirm his worst fear which i am not going to mention in this conversation the medical thing i am not going to mention sasa kuna dem anaitwa su na kuna dem anaitwa peris na kuna dem anaitwa gaso nyinyi wasichana watatu na watambua lakini mnajua ukweli lakini mwezi toka na msemi ukweli na mimi ninashangaa mnaogopa nini mtatishiwa na nani unajua the best gift yenye mnaweza patia sharon Niku, ni kusema ukweli members of the public hata kama law society of Kenya itakuja kuchukua hii maneno 
Munajua by the time by the time huyu dema nakufa vitu Sharon alisema vitu mtoto wake Sherin alikuwa anaambia mama yake mwenye anaitwa Sharon it was something that personally mimi mimi yani guys i'm telling you the truth it was very painful it was very shocking now the worst part of it ni kwamba even the ch the children were present during her last moment now may 21st 2022 Sharon called one of her friends. And akamwambia majamaa jo mimi anji wamenimaliza. Anji amenimaliza kabisa. Akaulizwa anji amekumaliza aje? Akasema imagine anji beshte yangu damu all along amekuwa kinidanganya na sasa hiyo jana walikuwa tunnel club inaitwa tunnel kitengela and the true the two true to her words slept together smashed each other na wewe anji leo usiku I am going to leak all those nudes. Zawewe na DJ Brownskin. It is the truth that we must tell the members of the public. Friends when you anajifanya ni friends wako lakini ni madui wako wanakuchukia. They don't wish you well. They don't want to see you grow. Aki mabishte zangu mungu wa suwapatie marafiki kama ude manaitu wa Angie. Now. Eh, Fiona. Mimo. Hmm. Mimo. Mimo, Mimo, Mimo. Hmm. Fiona. <laughs> eh. Fiona. Wewe, umikula DJ Brownskin. Na unajua bibi yake. Na udojua mbaka watoto wake. Fiona acha minu kwa ukweli. Fiona ulikuwa demu wa DJ alikuwa anaitwa chacha. Fiona sumekuwa deni ya DJ Chacha. Na DJ Chacha siyako na bibi. Na unajua mbaka bibi na watoto wa DJ Chacha. Fiona sikuna birthday ya watoto wa DJ Chacha ambayo uli attend. Na uliendanga mbaka na mtoto wako. Na wesi ndo the same same Fiona. Mwenye badu ulikuona unamove na DJ Brownskin. Kama si Sharon, mtu alipatianga DJ Brownskin akilia kukua mtu creative. Akilia kujib... Kama kuna mtu alibrand DJ Brownskin, ni uyu marehemu Sharon. May her soul rest in eternal peace. Sharon alikuwa anapenda baba yake sana. Adi Father's Day ama every Christmas, akikutana na mabeshte zake. Anapigia baba yake simu na analazimisha mabeshte wake wote waonge na baba yake. In fact... Sharon alikuwa napenda baba yake to an extent akisha patia mabeshte zake simu wakaongea waka na baba yake anawambia sasa mtumie baba yangu kitu ndio mpate baraka na kwa baba ya Sharon mimi nasema tu pole sana kenye ilifanyika si kitu mzuri mimi kama mkenya mimi kama kijana mjaluo mimi kama msema kweli nimelaani hiyo kitendo kwa ile strongest term possible juu tukisema kweli hata mtu haujui Ukipata kama amegongwa na ukipata kama amegongwa na gari ama amekanyagwa na pikipiki lazima tu struggle usaidie huyo mtu ukipata kama hata stranger na umia mahali ya konja hata ili umpatie fea yako useme nimetembea leo mpaka kwa nyumba lakini nimeokoa mai maisha DJ Brownskin na Diki na toshana na toothpick mfupi mfupi kama ile kitu watu kama ile kitu wapishwe na tumianga kubadilisha samaki after Sharon amekujenga ulikuwa natumia gari ya Sharon Toyota Wish Sharon amekujenga Sharon alikuombea Sharon alisimama na wewe mbako kanunua Noah ndio kaanza kukua mtu ndio kaanza tushika kushika tudo mimi yes hata mimi hata mimi ni mwanaume na naweza cheza demu yangu lakini siweza siwezi cheza demu yangu na mabeshte wake wa karibu naweza cheza demu yangu Lakini siyezi cheza demi yangu na dema na mjua. Na hata kama ni kucheza demi yangu. Eri ni mcheze na demu rembo kumliko. Yenye akiona at least anasema. Eh, nyewe this time round. Uliamuano ulikuwa siya. So ulichukua gunia ya maka. Unakula anji. Anji ni sister ya nyambu. Na bado shaniz ni mtoto wa nyambu. Sasa unakula mtu na niswake. Nyambu wene uko wapo tu mepanua mzewe. Shosho, shosho, unapenda rege. Kazi yako ni shosho, shosho, unuzama demu kwa rege. Kwendeni huko, riswa, mushindwe, mulemewe, mchombo njini, watu ambaya, mumeka mstiano wa mtu stress, mumefanya maisha yake mekua ngumu baka mtoto wa mungu, mtoto wa mtu wa menda mejua. Awalaani na kila siku mkilala mumuone, na wasumbue mbaka na watoto wenyu. 
amewachia huyo mwanaume chukweni huyo mwanaume muflos na yeye mu, mupige mashere venye mnataka mikufa amewachia dunia saini usi